Couple contaminate drought-stricken town's water supply by dyeing waterfall blue for gender reveal. Gender reveal parties are a blight. Just pop a balloon full of confetti and vacuum it up later. Don't do this. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Calvis. My name is Lumo, and today we are looking at r slash facepalm, a subreddit dedicated to people doing probably the stupidest thing you can imagine and winning the most coveted of awards, the Darwin Award. So let's just get right into it. Women who don't shave their underarms are trying to be men? A message for women who don't shave their underarms. It's not sexy, it's not empowering, it's nasty. Stop trying to be a man. You're not one, and if you have hairy pits, you're never gonna land one. I mean, there's a type for everyone, let's be real. If you are who you are, there is someone for you, and that is just a statistical fact. That said, I guess I'm a woman, because I shave my pits. Do what you want with your body. It's yours. You're the only one who has to be comfortable with it. If you don't want those measles, CDC monitoring measles outbreak in 21 states, including Michigan. Please don't vaccinate. I, I don't want my kids getting the measles. That's not how vaccines work. I look, the Internet has been a fantastic tool for making friends, and a lot of the best connections I've had came from the Internet. But it also causes this. And I think we just need to stop and appreciate the fact that you can have things both benevolent and maligned on the internet and people will believe both. You know what I want to believe in though? You subscribed to this channel. I want to believe it, so you should do it. You should also leave a like, comment, and share this with a friend. Use a reminder that belief is a two-way street. God believes in you. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with this. Belief is a two-way street. Believe in your friend that they will watch and I'll believe in you for subscribing and that's two streets. Let's get back into it. That'll get him to believe. Selling our son's birthday presents. We are selling all the toys our nine-year-old just received for his birthday three weeks ago. He's been acting out lately and said he doesn't believe in our religion and wants to be a scientist. We are fine with him wanting to learn, but he should learn about what? We can't tolerate him questioning and backtalking, so we are going to sell everything. Just so you know, we're going to make him watch this happen so the lesson really stinks in. All of the money will go to sending him to Bible camp this summer. I hope no one bought that. And in fact, I hope whoever pretended to buy it showed up and smacked you. Come on, that's how you get your child to not talk to you when they're older. Teacher defends his sexual relationship with a student by arguing his grades improved. Make sure you say pet yep. teacher. I'm so sick of the double standard. It's not nice. It's still traumatizing. Come on. Ah, this just boils my blood. Disgusting. Leeds millionaire's 100,000 pound arty vandalized with spray painted expletives. Oh, God. I mean, when you buy the Compensator 9000, it doesn't, it does not need the vandalism to prove the point. Sounds like a catch, ladies. If you're blood and taller than Tom Hardy, you must be younger. No addictions, including the food. Tattoo free, no piercings or special parts. No dogs, low, low body count, unvaxxed, no exceptions. Even if you are an 11, sorry, but you are too dumb and now worthless to me if you have taken it. I made 80k last year. If you're smart enough to figure out what I do, you will know I'm telling the truth. Extremely ambitious with warlord potential. If you have kids, that's really great, but you should have kept your bed. Oh. <laughs> There's too much to unpack there. We're moving on. My mom called my Christian university. That 17 year old me attend with by my parents behest to inform the school that I was smocking wed, drinking and having BX. She thought because it was a Christian university, they would put me into a counseling program to get me back on track. The school told me to pack my bags and leave immediately, and they rescinded 80% of the scholarship I obtained, causing me to owe the full 100% for that semester, which I'm still paying off a decade later. This comment is getting a lot of traction, so I figured I'd add another nugget. After getting kicked out of my college, my 18th birthday was next month. My parents, somehow, my dad is a tech nerd, so he could hack any account I had, found out that I was going to have a party at a friend's house to celebrate. There was alcohol and weed at the party. Lo and behold, my parents called the state police and alerted them to the party. I and three other friends got arrested that night. Most charges were dropped or expunged eventually. How to make your kids stop talking to you 101. Imagine being so fragile that different band-aid colors offend you. Our tone? Really? Woke bandages. This is 2023. Look, no one likes seeing bandages on their skin. That's just like a universal human fact. So these are fantastic and I'm glad they exist. Stop being such a baby, Courtney. Or should I say, Randy, the thing on your forehead is cultural appropriation of South Asian culture. 
That's a lot to take in. That's a lot to take in. That is a scab. That is a scab. That is a pop it to pimple. Oh my God. I hate, I hate Twitter. That's not even Twitter. I'm just, that's just a freebie. I hate whatever pl platform that is and I hate Twitter. Speaking of, Twitter is worse than Reddit. The term obese is a slur. Violent, dehumanizing. It's anti-black. What? I don't think I understand this one. What? Can I pay Austrians US minimum wage if they are located in Austria? Hello Austrians! I'm planning on hiring some intern bilingual Austrian students for IT internships. I plan on paying the project management interns minimum wage because they are the least important. US minimum wage is $7.25 an hour and I think the Austrian is $20. I simply can't in good conscience pay the project management interns $20. Any help would be appreciated. Calling them the least important definitely doesn't impact how you'll treat them, but project managers are essential. What are you saying? You're stupid. You're, you're, you're a bingus. You're a, a donkamo. Health advice? Bill Gates is seven months younger than me. Do you think any of his health advice is worth following? Uh, he eradicated polo on a few continents. You've been bumping your vanity, so yeah. I mean, on a macro level of getting vaccinated and stuff, yeah, I would believe Bill Gates. I don't think I'd ask him for diet or workout advice, but I feel like he's probably got some good takes, yeah. Not all of them. Some of them are pretty bad, but some of them are pretty good. Sorry, you what? How can you just ignore a bite from a wild animal? Girlfriend 25F, bit by a monkey now experiencing symptoms. Two weeks ago, we went into the Amazon rainforest and a wild monkey bit my gif, 25 female, when she tried petting it. We didn't think much of it, but kept going on with our lives. Last Monday, she started feeling discomfort in her jaw, which soon evolved into pain when she tried to open it. Now she has a headache and feels tension and electricity in her trapezius muscle and her neck. I think she may have tetanus, but her jaw pain may be caused by bad movement. Should we be worried? You might have rabies. My god, how could you just ignore that? Never touch wild animals. If they look friendly, something's gone bad. Alpha versus beta dating test. Can I take you out? Can I kiss you? Can I see you tonight? Major BS. Asking for permission will screw up your power in the relationship. Asking for permission is a beta male's vibes. Beta vibes repel women. Alphas go for it. If you feel like kissing her, go for it. If you want to take her up, be like, hello, steakhouse tonight, 740 shop, be on time. As a man, be concise and clear. Limit your presence. Don't be available seven days in a week. If you want to see her, two days a week isn't enough. Prioritize your perp, your hustle, job, your training, gym sessions by allocating the remaining five days to them. Why? When you spend more time building yourself, you'll always be an upgraded version of yourself every time you get to see her. Better financially, better physically, better mentally. She won't help it, but fall more in love with you, a high-value man. She'll make the most of that time more than you ever will. She'll even doubt you're not seeing other women as well. That's what being a high-value man will do for you? Mmm. You know what I love? Making my partner feel insecure in their relationship by not giving them enough time and making them think I'm cheating. This is written by someone who does not get women and is just kind of a jerk off who's trying to find any excuse to put it on anyone else. Following this advice is awful. Work on yourself or treat your partners well. Science spelled backwards is a canis. Nice. Is that a place used by pagans to summon Satan himself to pray on children and turn them into literal sheep? These pagans were called scientists. <laughs> I, I can't finish this. Why is it tagged flat earth? Why are they summoning fabrics? <laughs> I'm a nyan test. I summon cat girl. <laughs> I can't stop laughing at this reason for Twister's PG-13 rating. Rated PG-13, intense depiction of very bad weather. This one time I saw a severe lightning storm as a child and it changed me for life. I'm glad this is here. Stay in task. Treat your kids well, then they'll start to love you. My children will get privacy from M when they can pay their own bills and feed themselves. Until then, you do what I say. Ain't not negotiable. We're not friends. I haven't spoken to my mothers in 10 years. Welcome to your future. What a nightmare. What a nightmare. What a jerk. I bet this guy list does not listen to the scientists and summon Satan. <laughs> it's in my mind. Everyone wants your email address. Think twice before sharing it. Thanks for reading the Times. Create your free account or log in to continue reading. Ew. 
And that's all the time we have for today on Galvis. If you like this, make sure to subscribe, leave a like, maybe share this with a friend who could use a reminder of the Nyan Tast who are summoning cat boys. If you do want more r slash facepalm, there'll be another one popping up on your screen in just a couple of seconds. But until then, my name has been Lumo, and I hope to see you in the very next Galvis video. Have a great rest of your day. <laughs> <laughs>